First at 5 o'clock, the Oklahoma Highway Patrol says two 15-year-old boys and a 17-year-old girl were killed in a car crash in Rural Creek County yesterday. Sepulpa Public School says two of those teenagers were students there. Thanks for joining us. I'm Lori Fulbright. And I'm Craig Day. Troopers say a 16-year-old boy was driving the car yesterday afternoon and is in the hospital right now in critical condition. News on 6's Reagan Ledbetter is live at the scene with what neighbors have been saying about what happened. Reagan. Craig and Lori actually just talked to the cousin of 17 year old Lacey Krause. He says she was one of the passengers in the car. He says he came by to plant flowers for Lacey and also plans to put up a cross. Also, one of the friends of Lacey showed up. She tells me Lacey was such a great person who had so much going for her. Now, several people who live in this area tell me this stretch of road is just such a dangerous stretch because it's rugged, it's narrow, and people go way too fast. Troopers say they believe the driver was speeding when he went off the road and crashed into a tree northwest of Sepulpa. Oh, it's so sad. It's so sad. It's, I mean, it's horrible when anybody loses a life, but a young person, it's just, you know, it's devastating. Troopers say the three passengers were all ejected from the car and the driver was pinned inside. This is a very rural county road, uh, asphalt in nature. Uh, you know, there's no shoulders here. So unfortunately on county roads like this, there's not a lot of room for error. So if your speed's too high or if you make a mistake or something of that nature, you don't have a lot of room to correct it. Debbie Stickler has lived around here for more than 20 years and she says this stretch of road has always been a problem. They need some barriers or something because the road kind of dog -like especially at night. There's nothing here to mark this. And if you're unfamiliar with this portion of the road, you don't tell that the road drops off. It's such a straight stretch. Once they come down that hill, most of the time they're flying. If they don't realize that culvert's there, you know, their tire go off in it and flip, hit a tree, do whatever. It's just, it's just devastating. Now, troopers say the exact cause of the crash is still under investigation. We'll have more from friends of the victims coming up tonight at 9 and 10. Live in Creek County, Reagan Ledbetter, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.